What's up guys, Aaron here and today I'm bringing you guys the fourth episode of this Borussia Dortmund career mode. But as you guys can see, I'm actually in the middle of a match and that is because my uh, game capture actually stopped working and then I lost all the footage from before. But what has happened is that we have signed uh, Moran as well as we have signed Jesse Rodriguez. As well as we just have scored a goal with Robert Lewandowski. Uh, to make it 1-0 over Werder Bremen and uh, so yeah I'm really really sorry for that not much I can do with that to be really honest but first of all I just wanted to thank you guys much for all the support that you guys have shown this series so far it's really really greatly appreciated but here you guys can see Jesse Rodriguez is our new signing he got some nice stats on him as you guys can see a really pacey ag agile player there with a lot of ball control and dribbling as well as Forster skills. As well as he can play as a striker, he can play as a centre forward, as well as he can play out to the left and out to the right, so that can be a pretty good signing. Only 20 years old as well. And it is Robert Lewandowski which scored the first goal for us in this match. And it was a shot from around 16 meters which went down to the to the left corner of the goalkeeper. But now we are gonna go into the second half and hopefully I can score some goals. But uh, the thing I, I forgot to say to you guys is that E.K. Gundogan is going to be out for three weeks. That is some really bad news. But he's out with a sprained knee so it is going to take at least three weeks for him to get back to play football for us again. But we're probably going to do all the right because we got a lot of good players in the squad. So Hopefully we're not going to get more injuries and that was a training injury as well so that's a bit sad to get that. But yeah so guys this was it for the full time whistle, didn't really happen too much in the second half uh, besides for the goal with Lewandowski in, the, in 39 minutes so sorry again for the lost footages but anyway that is just how it is. We have actually received an offer from Manchester United on Marcel Smelcher so uh, I saw in the comments that you guys didn't really enjoy me uh, putting him on the transfer list so we're just gonna reject that and uh, just disallow all future offers on Marcel Smelcher since we need him for a bit of depth in the defense. If you guys are interested in squad reports and stuff like that I'm gonna do that every fifth episode. I'm not gonna do that every episode because that is just not gonna work out. I'm not too sure if the, it is squad report on this either, so... Here we got another offer for Cal. We're just gonna reject that offer because Cal is still a good player. He's 33 years old, he got a, he's a really experienced player and uh, he can come in handy to have on the bench. A bit of a messy episode this because of the lost footage. But anyway, hopefully you guys enjoy it. And we're soon gonna start off Champions League as well. That is gonna be in the fifth episode. That is going to be featuring a uh, Champions League play against Real Sociedad, as well as some uh, league. So yeah guys, it is time to play the first match of this episode, well the second match, but it is going to be the first full match of this episode. So that is going to be against ha Hamburger, so hopefully we can get out to a good start on this one. So yeah guys, it is time to play against Hamburger. And as you guys can see on the table, we have won 4 out of 4, so is Schalke, and Bayern Munich has won 5 out of 5, so they are on the top of the league with 15 points. So now we're just going to take a look at our team, as you guys can see it is the same 11, but it is Gundogan which has come in. Jesse Rodriguez is on the bench, possibly going to make his debut today. And here is Hamburger's team in a 4-2-3-1 formation that as well. So they got some pretty nice players here in attack. That is probably going to be Van der Vaart and Ilicevic, which is going to be the most threatening players. But they got a really good player up there with Radwens as well. He's really good in the air, so this can be really tough. Lewandowski over the top three ball to uh, Aubameyang, which are going to put that one through, and that is beautiful play. Beautiful play there and Bender is gonna finish that one. So we're leading 1-0 in this match and that is Bender, Swen Bender with the goal. Beautiful little play there between Lewandowski and Bender. And Kitarian gonna pass that one through to Lewandowski which is gonna reach the ball but didn't manage to do anything with it so that is gonna go out for a goal kick. It is still 1-0. But anyway guys, that was it for the half time whistle, we're leading 1-0 with the goal from Benda, so absolutely dominating this match as well, 
Uh, take a look at his stats. We got three shots. They got one. So not really too much happening. But anyway, we feel like we are in control. Beautiful pass through to Pichet. Can you score the first goal of the season? Yes, you can. Guys, it is 2-0. Pichet with an awesome goal there in the 16th minute. Just as it, it went in. Aubameyang with the through pass. And look at that finish. Look at that for a finish. Absolutely beautiful. It is time to bring on the new players. It is time to bring on Jesse Rodriguez. And that is going to be Lewandowski, which obviously has been, a, has been upgraded to an 87. Look at those stats. It's absolutely beautiful. So Jesse Rodriguez is going to come in. Balazikovsky is going to come in from uh, Henrik. Going to put Royce in the middle there. And then uh, Nuri Sain is going to come in for, um, for Aubameyang. And uh, Nuri Sain is going to go into the middle and Royce out to the right. Oh, they are on the attack here. Arslan. Oh, we actually managed to miss the target there. And uh, the referee actually decided to blow off the whistle. So we, we won this match 2-0, guys. It was two players that don't score too often. So it was Lucas Pischek and Sven Bender, which scored a goal. So we won this match 2-0. And that was pretty much what happened in this episode. It might be a bit short, but that is because of the footage which got lost. In the next episode, we are going to start off playing some uh, Champions League football. So stay tuned for that. If you guys enjoyed the video, hit that like button as well as subscribe if you already haven't. That would have been greatly appreciated. Thank you for watching and have a nice day. Goodbye. Senorita and she looking tasty I'm dirty dancing with her Call me Patrick Swayze Hey Carly call me maybe Better yet call me baby I can take you across the globe But first please get